Hello, welcome to LibreOffice Writer's video tutorial series. In this video, we will discuss about how to check the spellings of the Word document and how to enable or disable automatic spell checker. So, we can see there are two icons with the check mark and ABC return. So, first one is for for spelling grammar so what by it we mean that it will show the whole text available in that word document and then what are the kind of suggestions or what are the mistakes available within this word document so since we haven't done anything in this so it will not show anything but if we have enter if we will enter some some random text then obviously it will start working so now we have written five words three are grammatically wrong alphabet the spellings are wrong and the last two are right so if we just try to check if the spell checker can detect the right words is wrong then since uyg yuk is not a valid word it will suggest alternatives but since so let's consider muggy to be the alternative for this word then just select the word and say correct and then it's replaced with muggy because muggy is something which we selected and now we want uhu to be um replaced with ahu then just correct you let's say chihuahua so now we all have the correct words the corrects according to the dictionary available in library office what automatic spell checker does is so in case you will just start typing something it will automatically check if the spellings within the documents are correct or not so if we disable this then it won't show anything because now the spellings are unchecking uh, checked automatically so if we really need to check then we need to click on that on the first icon to really check the spellings so the best method would be to to enable the automatic spell checker and how do we know if it is selected or not it's slightly embossed it's slightly darkened which means that it's selected so as of now the automatic spell checker is enabled which is the default property in library office sector thank you for watching the video in the next video we'll discuss about how to cut copy paste the content within LibreOffice Writer.